Hello, I'm Liviu Balan and today I will speak about comparing files on PHP Storm. So, let's get started. First, during this tutorial, I will use a personal project of mine named livibalancom background ubuntu If you want to learn more about this project, I encourage you to check out the useful links section and from here, verify the github.com URL. Uh, okay, so let's talk about comparing files on PHP Storm. During this tutorial, I will show you three different, different ways to do this. And uh, each of these methods uh, is uh, prefixed with a number. Here you can see the first approach, comparing two files. The second one, compare file with editor. And the third one, compare with. So let's talk about the first option, comparing two files on PHP Storm. First, as you can see here, I have my livibalancom background ubuntu github repository project opened in PHP Storm. I've expanded the share directory and inside of it, the compare directory. Inside of the compare directory, I have three files file-1, file-2, and file-3.txt. Let's open each of them by double-clicking on each of them. You can see here that I have uh, three text files, and during this tutorial, I will compare the content uh, of them between uh, each of these files. So, in order to compare two files, uh, the first thing you will have to do is to select two files. In order to do this, you have uh, several methods. One of the method is to click on a file and then press and hold the control key and then click the second file. If you want to uh, unselect a specific file, for example, if I want to unselect the file-1.txt file, all I have to do is to press and hold again the control key and then click on it. Now, if I want to choose another file, press and uh, hold the control key and click on file-3.txt for example. Another approach will be to select a range of files by using the press and holding uh, the shift uh, key and then click on a specific file. For example, if I want to uh, select file-1 and file-2.txt, all I have to do is to click on file-1.txt, press and hold the shift key and then select the file-2.txt by clicking on it. You can select multiple files by using the shift key. For example, I can click the file-1.txt press and hold the shift key and click on file-3.txt. You will see that by using this approach, I was able to select three files by doing only two clicks. Okay, now let's choose uh, file uh, dash, uh, let's uh, choose uh, file dash one and file dash uh, two.txt and compare them. Another approach, if you want to use the keyboards, you can use the shift key and then the uh, up and down arrows. This will uh, have the same meaning by uh, clicking the control uh, key and then clicking on a specific file or by uh, using uh, shift and control. It's up to you uh, what approach you want to uh, do but uh, the result will have to be the same. So let's uh, select file-1 and file-3.txt and after this, all I have to do is to right click on uh, this menu here on these files and choose uh, an option from a menu named compare files. PHP Storm will uh, show you by default, uh, will uh, slightly marks the differences, extra value, different values, and so on. 
So let's do these steps. Select file dash one, then file dash two.txt. Right click on uh, on them. Choose compare files, and as you can see here, you can see uh, the slightly difference between them. As you can see here, here is uh, is a is an addition uh, from uh, this line, so is marked with green, and uh, one and two dot txt are marked with blue because this is an editing. This is a difference, not an addition. Okay, let's close this window. You can do this by pressing the S key or this button here, the close button. I will uh, press the S key. And uh, what I want to show you next is that only two files can be compared. If I uh, use control again and select file-3.txt by clicking on it and right click on these files, you will see that uh, the compare files option is not listed here. This is because only two files can be compared. Okay. Now let's compare file dash two and three dot txt. You will see that uh, inside of the comparing window, uh, you will have uh, the chevron buttons, which is this one, two greater than or two less than uh, symbols. And uh, this button will be used to replace the content from one panel to another. And uh next we will look at the toolbar uh, text value which will be replaced okay select um, file dash 2 and 3.txt choose compare files and the chevron button buttons that i've told you are this one if i go on a specific chevron button you will see the tooltip, tool tip, which will be replaced. Let's go here and you will see here again replace. So you will see that the difference between file-2.txt and file-3.txt are two. You will see here that I have two differences. The first difference is this one. On line two, I have this text and on line two and three on the second file, I have this text. <clears throat> now, if I click on uh, this chevron button, the replace button, you will see that this line here will be replaced with this line here. So if I click the replace button, you will see that instead of uh, three, li uh, three lines of text, now I have four lines of text and uh, the text here on file-2.txt were replaced with the text here inside of file-3.txt. Now, if I uh, quit the differences window here and go to file-2.txt, you will see that now I have a different content. Uh, and if I want to go back to the previous changes, all I have to do is to uh, use the Ctrl Z uh, option to undo the changes. Let's choose OK here to undo the changes. And now I don't have any changes inside of my file-2.txt. Now uh, I will compare again file-2 and 3.txt. But instead of pressing the chevron buttons, uh, before uh, doing this, I will press and hold the Ctrl key. And you will see that the chevron buttons here will be replaced by uh, another kind of buttons. And inside of the tooltip, you will see a text named insert. So let's choose compare uh, files again on file dash two and three dot txt. And here on the comparing window, I will press and hold the control key. You will see here whenever I will press and hold the control key, uh, the chevron buttons, uh, the replace buttons will be replaced with another kind of buttons. And if I go 
uh, here, you will see that uh, the tooltip changed to insert text. Now, the difference, you will see it uh, in a moment. Uh, as you saw earlier, when I've uh, pressed this button here, replace, the text here on the second line were replaced with the text here on line two and three uh, inside of the second file. Now, if I press and hold the control key and uh, press the insert button, you will see that instead of four lines of text that I have uh, that I had earlier, now I have five lines of text now. This is because the second line remains the same. You will see here file-2.txt, but the text uh, from the second file were added here. In terms of informatics, we named uh, this option appending. So the text from one part were added at the end of the other part. Now let's uh, close this window for now and let's undo the changes on file-2.txt by using Ctrl Z. Undo. And next I will show you another option on comparing files. Uh, next I will again compare file-2 and 3.txt but instead of press and hold the control key, I will press and hold the shift key. And you will see that the chevron buttons will uh, become an uh, X button and the tooltip will be revert. So let's choose uh, compare files on file-2 and 3.txt. And here on this window, I will press and hold the shift key. And you will see the X is here. If I go on this X, X here, you will see that the option is revert. So now if I press and hold the shift key and click the revert button here, you will see that the text on my uh, left side were replaced with the text on my right side. So let's use Ctrl Z here, you will see that the result is something like pressing the replace button here. Let's press and hold the shift key to revert this option. Now I have four lines of text and the text on uh, line two and three are this one. Let's use Ctrl Z again. And now use replace button here. You will see here the same content. So uh, using uh, this option here, revert is a shortcut for replacing text. Okay, now let's talk about another option on comparing files uh, named compare file with editor. Let's open file-1.txt by right clicking on it or click on a specific tab if you have opened the file. And now let's go to file-3.txt, right click on it and choose uh, compare file with editor. Now uh, what this option will do is to open uh, the comparing window and inside of it will compare file-3.txt which is the current file that I want to compare and file-1.txt which uh, is the file opened currently inside of my editor. So choose compare file with editor and you will see here file-3.txt which is the file that I want to compare and file-1.txt which is the file currently opened inside of my uh, editor. Let's close this window for now and let's talk about the third option uh, of comparing files inside of PHPStorm, which is compare with. To do this, I will click on file-1.txt, right click on it and here I will choose uh, compare with. 
uh, now a uh, window uh, for selecting the path uh, will be opened here and from here I will choose file-2.txt and as you can see now I am comparing file-1.txt which is the current uh, selected file uh, inside of my menu and file-2.txt which is the file selected from the choose path uh, window. Let's close this window for now and uh, as you saw this is how to compare files in PHP Storm. Uh, if you want to learn more about uh, PHP Storm, about web technology, um, web technologies, I encourage you to check out my website livibalan.com and uh, see my tutorials on YouTube. Thank you for watching. Bye bye.